What's going on? <laughs> it's a dramatic opening, but hey, everybody, welcome <laughs> That's back. terrible. Blow up that thing. Blow up that thing. Oh, shiny rocks means he's going to show up. Yeah, or that you I can believe actually blow up. what I want to do here is actually go up. Oh, also, look at that shit. I can blow up the mines now. Mm. Oh. Although I guess mines haven't been my greatest weakness in this playthrough. I, in my personal playthrough, they always got me. I would just not They're see large, them. They're large, non-moving objects. It's it's the colors, man. Like, I just don't see the colors. Oh, come on. He's Terrible. Gonna, he's going to show up. There he is. Uh, run, 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 run. Cheater. Dude, no. I'm a professional. <laughs> Turn this a million times. So, this is the whole boss battle, by the way. Like, this isn't... I was wondering. Yeah, this isn't leading up to Go. some, like... Go. Oh, fucking... Oh, really? <laughs> I had to listen to you. Oh, no! Oh, there was the black ooze that I can never see! <laughs> ah! Although, an interesting tidbit. They, uh, they lock us in here. So we pick up the harpoon and now we can't get out. So we actually have to fight him. The you same... The missile launcher? The, the torpedo? The torpedo. Yeah. So, okay. Which, the same thing happened, actually, when we fought the chain gang. Um, normally you can just, like, jump ship and leave a boss battle. Just be like, well, this is too hard. Later. But there are the occasional so they're few. optional? Yeah, no, there are definitely optional boss battles in oh, this Oh, that's game. how they do the speed run and... Yeah, yeah, they Eight just they just hours. don't do all the bosses. It makes We're, sense if you don't have to do it. Why do it? Yeah, I mean, as far as speed runs go, are concerned. Go, 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 go. All right, I'm getting much better at this. All right. Um, but I, I like fighting the bosses. I mean, they're the most interesting part of the game, you know? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Without a doubt. <laughs> They're, like, they're for, the game, really. You could for a design show. I feel like it would be a really big lost opportunity if we didn't do some of the bosses, just because it's like, oh, we don't have to. It's like, why are we rushing through the series? Nick would do that. Nick would do that, which is why. That's why he's not on the show. Ha <laughs> Where is he? There he is. No, well, that's why. Like sometimes with the Pragmatic Saga, I'm just like, Nick, let's listen to the dialogue for Christ's sake. We're missing out on the experience. Yeah. Oh, what are the? What is that thing? It's driving me nuts, man. What's with the mouths? <laughs> Crash compactors, man. All right, I'm trying bah. to see. I can see little bubbles. Bah. I'm waiting for this black ooze to go away. It's really hard to see. Is what it gone? Black, black ooze. This stuff right here. It's oil, maybe. Maybe. Just go. Boom. <laughs> you just did just, it. Just go with it. Did it. Done. <laughs> See, why did they put the pinwheel thing next to the cog thing? Hmm. What? It's so confusing. I don't even know what you're shooting to activate the thing anymore. It's You can kind of tell because it, it's got a little, like, glowy ends. That, I guess overall that's just the one thing about the game. Too hard to see, unfortunately. And look at that. Now look we that. can finally blow oh. up these things. Boom, jams. That's that's awesome. Blow that up. What? What just? You didn't. Nothing happened. He's totally gonna come out of there. Come on, boogie, yep. boogie, 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 boogie. So they like uh, let you know ahead of time that he's coming. I wonder if they did that on purpose. They're like, oh, this thing's totally gonna blow up. We're gonna let okay. you know. Okay. Oh, ah, look at that. Look at that. Oh Fork shit. Shadow. Fuck. Oh god. <laughs> Woo. Oh man, that was close. <laughs> God, I really thought I was going to die there. Uh, so, if you answered our question last time on w if those obstacles Wait, well, were going on, to be on. fully utilized or not. Check this shit out. Huh? Wait, hmm? Huh? Trash compactor? Yep. <laughs> well, oh, so good. Now that, that'd make some good sushi. <laughs> Shoot it. I don't think I can do anything. Oh. I know, right? I feel like you should be able to blow it up. Oh. But that's still awesome. See, I like, mean, at that point, you've already, <clears throat> like, do you really need to rub salt in a wound? No. No. 
But see why I really like that boss battle? It's like a very different change of pace for the bosses no in joke, this game. Yeah. In like one of the most fun ways possible. And like from a, a game design and even a coding standpoint, like that probably didn't require a ton of extra work. But it was a really creative like way to handle a boss. It was it basically was um, a change of pace on how to do a level. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. It and was they, and they, they disguised it as a boss fight. And I love that. That's oh, yeah. Awesome. I, I wonder, too, if... Uh, I don't want to fast travel. I think there's stuff. There's things I need. Um, I wonder <laughs> things if, I need. Blow them up. <laughs> I wonder if you can beat that boss battle if you've never gotten any of the speed upgrades. Because I think we've gotten at least one. At least. And that was hard, right? Um, but as so long as I was like very precise with my movement, I yeah. could do it. So I it was feel really like... that up down one that was the hardest one for you. After that, mm -hmm. they weren't really an issue. Yeah, that last one like you messed up and you still got through without dying. Okay, so here's a question: Should we spend some time going around getting some of those upgrades that we keep passing up because we don't have the torpedoes? Do you feel like we need those things? I think it would be very useful, especially for fighting things like the Parasite, because the next few bosses are going to be getting a lot more challenging a lot faster. Um, so I feel like if we don't get it now, it's going to be one of those things where it's like, we're going to have to get it eventually anyway. I'll compromise with you. Hmm. We can do it, but only if we do it in montage. Montage? Okay, we can do that. All right. Montage. Going on a montage. Ooh. Montage. I'm gonna pause here. So basically, now every time we find something, we can just cut it like that, like that. Wow, that was actually an upgrade I could have gotten before, I think. Yes. Cool. Harpoon speed. Yeah. Now we can go here. Although I think this is just a shortcut. I could be wrong though. We gonna see this is. Um, yeah, just a shortcut, I guess. To what? What is, what is it a fast travel to? I don't know. Can you blow something up? Unless I've been in here before. Maybe you have. I don't know how, because this is to the... Oh, wait! What is this? Is this an interactable thing? Oh, dude. This is a secret that I haven't seen. What is it? What did you find? What is it? It glowed and made noises. Ah! Okay, well, we found a secret. I guess we'll find out what that is. I think all we had to do was activate it. You activated something, man. Oh, I'm excited now. This is new stuff for me. All right, we found another secret. What is, There's what is a little thing? explodable wall over here. Oh, man. So oh, man, I what's in here? don't know. Maybe this is another gem. I feel like anytime we're going out of bounds in the uh, environment, it's probably something like super secret like that. Ooh. Why is that? I've definitely not been oh. over here before in what? my uh, personal playthrough. Good. Oh, so God. What if it's a boss? That would be actually that would be awesome. That's one of my favorite things that I've done in in um, any kind of like explorative games that I've made is uh, I love love hiding just like ridiculously challenging bosses. I mean, it makes sense, especially if that's like a big part of your game or what mm -hmm. like put putting hard challenges where it's not mandatory. But yeah, the uh, very first game I ever made while I was at school is awful, awful, terrible, like, action platformer game called uh, Shatter Earth. Oh. Harpoon explosions. <gasps> what? I, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta shoot something. You. Uh, you missed. It, uh, it just bounced off. Alright. What? What? Well, <laughs> we'll, uh, <laughs> I, uh, Come on, man. You should... Oh, okay, here we go. I don't... I don't understand. I feel like... Go under those other trees, though. That thing didn't show up until you were, like, under the tree. What do you mean? It didn't show up? Like, the, the I didn't see the secret until you were practically under the tree. So I was just saying, oh. like, stick, you know, stick to the, under the trees. 
Hmm. But, but you know, meh. But really, harpoon explosions, what? Did it show up as an upgrade thing? It didn't show up here, so it's. I think it's just on the, uh, the harpoons now. Unless it's like, if I supercharge it? That might be a possibility. Or maybe if I, like, right click? Well, we'll figure that out. <laughs> Alright, we found another one. What is it? What is it? Boom! Hull repair speed. Yeah! That's actually a good deal. But uh, we found awesome. something else out we, really important. We learned what the explosive harpoons are. If we shoot the torpedo, see all those torpedoes that shoot out? Boom! So Radius. your harpoon, or your torpedoes shoot harpoons, <laughs> not the other way around. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. It would have definitely been useful during that, uh, the, sh the chain gang. Oh my god, yes. But, uh, you know, we didn't have torpedoes back then anyway, so. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Uh, moving on. Moving on. <laughs> Alright. So I keep blowing up these little secret areas, like the little blockades before we we come back, but yeah, we found another oh, one. no idea what you're... Huh? We're actually starting to find these a lot faster, too, now that we're like actually looking actively for looking for them, yeah. Hull upgrade! Yeah! Hey, it's, uh, it's a little, but you know, it will... We got ourselves a heart tank, y'all. Yeah, buddy! Cool, on to the next one. Boom, baby! I remember this one actually. I found this in my uh, personal playthrough because I saw this tree with the little dangly bit, and I was like, "That's a rather unique a art asset. It must mean something." And sure enough, it did. And it. Does. I love it when it does. Dude, right? Ah, oh, look, there's a reason. What's the reason? The um, it's those little candies that you eat in a the movie theater. What are you? Whoa! Oh, was that a secret within a secret? My God! Oh! Two. We found a second one. What do you do? Tell me. What is the secret of your power, Wonder Boy? Uh, I love Tenacious D. <laughs> I, I hope people get that reference. But really, though, I want to know what that does. Is there anything else in here? I wonder. Whoa. Oh, ah, 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 ah. ah, ah. Oh, hey. the volcano. Look at that. Hey, there was. Whole repair speed. Definitely need that. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, sweet. Whoa! Ah. It's okay. It's okay. My whole my whole repair speed is increased. <laughs> <laughs> All right, on to the next one. All right. So we're not gonna lie, we cheated for this one. Yeah. Well, we we uh we found this one in a, a walkthrough, or at least like a secret guide. I'm gonna look those. Just because we were trying to figure out. Up. Yeah, we were trying to figure out what those gems were doing, right? And then. Intangible stumbled across this one, and apparently, holy shit! If we sit, if we sit here for about a minute, uh, a secret patches passage is gonna open. But what I didn't notice before is that the camera zooms into this location, and the tablet lights up. Ah, how did we not notice that before? Because we did. We were over here, and we were like, "What is this? This is crazy." Is that a Z A? There's more of these. Is it another gem? I I don't know what's in here. Oh, I, I know what's in it, and he doesn't. And I also know what it does, and he doesn't. <gasps> that that tells me that this is going to be something fun. Something quite excite. Oh, it's another gem! Bing! How many do you think there are? I know exactly how many there are. How many are there? That's it. That's three? That's three. What do they do? Did you find that out? Yes, I did, but I don't... I didn't look it up to see if that's all you had to do. So we'll find out on the next part of the montage. <laughs> will, we will? I guess. Also, I'm trying to look up what, what Nikto Zebit. <laughs> what that the phrase on the tomb actually said? Yeah. Because I'm wondering if that was supposed to be the, uh, the, the hint as to what you do I, I like a just, safe friend and enter kind of thing except like I hang out for a bit buddy nobody is <laughs> nobody's oh that's pretty grim but i guess that makes maybe sense it's like game. you whoa okay what? hear me out <laughs> i like what where is this going 
most people don't like that's in a different language right? right they could have chosen english because everything else in the game is english but they chose a different language so you get there you see the words you pull up your phone or your device you oh. look it up trying to figure out what it's saying and while you're not paying attention the stoneway opens up dude that's genius oh this my genius. god it's please, perfect. Please contact us and tell us if that's what you wanted. <laughs> I mean, we could message them I, on like Twitter fine, or something and be like, hey, dudes, is this, is this what you had in mind? That's insane. But that, that is pretty genius, though. Like, especially because that whoop, that totally fits the theme of, of like exploration, right? Like, you're going to get people that have that kind of mindset that are like, i got to figure out everything. Like, if you're already going around reading all the, the logs that have been scattered across, like, you're going to want to know what that tablet says. So, yeah, yeah that is intense. really smart. All right, well, uh, next part of the montage. I oh, guess, hey, look oh, that. look at that. The next part of the montage. Wow. Hole upgrade. Sweet. <laughs> All right. And he found another one. Yeah. Here's another one. This one I actually legitimately stumbled upon. I was just, like, s hitting against the wall, and, and then <laughs> I went in, and I was like, whoa. Mesh test and Pepsi. Whoa. Whoa. What? Uh. Um. Uh, okay, so hardcore mode. Oh, so you accidentally unlocked it. I don't know if that necessarily activates it, though. We unlocked it, but... So, go back to the center of that room. Okay. So, apparently, there's three crystals, right? We unlocked them, and then, there they are. There's the blue sparkles. So, like, when you go... Remember that lighthouse? When you go this, in front of the lighthouse, the blue sparkles show up and lead you to that area. Oh, no kidding! So you literally did stumble across <laughs> it, but that area is also not like there and visible unless you have uh, the three crystals. Really? Okay, so that's what the three crystals are for. They light the way, they activate the lighthouse, which then when you get to the lighthouse, shows those blue sparkles which get you to the, the place. Weird. So, I don't even know what hardcore mode does, and hopefully it's not immediately activated, because you're having a hard time already. Well, okay, to be fair, now that we have the upgrades, this will be a lot easier. Um, the only thing I need now is the boost, and then I'll be, I'll be golden. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I think that's a good place to leave off for the montage. Yeah, yeah, I think we've gotten our fair share of upgrades at this point. There are still some more scattered about, but I think those we can still kind of get as we're, we're playing along. Yeah, absolutely. So, uh, well, yeah, well. Everybody. Uh, question of the day. Secrets. Yeah, Something secrets. Something to do with it. Um, I mean, there's a few questions we could ask about the secrets. I guess maybe... Let's talk about the hardcore mode. Yeah, I, I kind of want to talk about hardcore, yeah. Har normally, hardcore mode. Normally in a hardcore mode, uh, you just play the game and you beat it, and then you'll be like, be like, unlock hard mode, and then you play hard mode, and then you'll beat it, mm -hmm. and then, then hardcore mode will be allowed, or something crazy like that. Right. But not this time. Yeah, it, it is a very interesting choice to make hardcore mode something you have to actually go and find. Yeah, you had to discover. In the discovery game, you had to discover the hardcore <laughs> mode. Also, it doesn't tell you what it does, which is very typical of the game. It just lets you discover it and find out on your own. So, so, so maybe the question is both: is that appropriate for a game like this? And, um, like, uh, what did you think about like the the way they hit it? Like the <laughs> lack of information. Yeah, is it lack a good of reward? information. Is it a good reward for, for what we had to go through? Yeah, because, like, the whole time, like, he eventually found it, but I still was like, what is it? Like, is it the ultimate power? Like, do I get some sort of mega weapon? Um, and so, like, hardcore mode was not what I expected, but no. still is super cool regardless. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm really curious. But, yeah. I know what it does, I guess. But anyway, yeah, what do you think about how to unlock the hardcore mode, what are your yeah. opinions on that, and uh, what, uh, I don't know, have you, would you have done anything differently? I guess, is the question of the day. Yeah, I don't, e I don't even know either, like, I have to ponder this one for a bit. Uh, but thanks for watching everybody, and uh, I hope you enjoyed the montage, it was actually kind of fun to do. Montage! Montage! Alright, take it easy everyone. <laughs> Later bruh. Bruh.